for science. <laughs> Previously, I made a large quantity of zinc chloride solution from dumping pennies into hydrochloric acid. What else can we do with this penny juice? Looking on Info Galactic, it appears that zinc chloride in concentrations higher than 64% will dissolve cellulose, such as toilet paper or paper towels. I've never seen this. Let's make it happen. First, I evaporated it to increase the concentration. When I came back the next day, the solution had solidified. So I melted it back down. Once the solution was finally dissolved again, I started feeding strips of paper towels into it. It definitely is dissolving, but only when submerged. Here it just appears to be floating on the surface. I'll have to push the paper towel down into the solution to dissolve more of it. That appears to work pretty well. Here's four more paper towels. The solution at this point has dissolved twice its volume, and now appears to be boiling. So what happens when you put the solution in water, and the concentration goes below 64%? The solution was too hot for a plastic pipette to work. Swirling around, you can see tiny little fibers. Let's see what happens when you dump the whole thing in. And it's black. The cellulose was very slow to strain out, and the liquid was left an orangey color. Mmm, black sludge. If you have any uses for black sludge, please comment below. This is the fourth video in a series exploring the chemistry of zinc chloride. I have no idea if I'm going to make any more.